Hey guys, it's Emperor Shay Shay. I'm just coming on for a short message. Um, if you hear something in the background, that's my fan. <laughs> I got kind of hot trying to finish up my Christmas stuff. Um, I'm coming on for my Divine Feminines. It's a general reading. Um, or either the collective, but it's mainly towards my feminines. Um, the spiritual leaders and teachers. Um, that is high, um, higher fonts. Okay? Because I am a higher font. I am a hierophant. <laughs> I am a magical leader. Okay. Um, magician alchemy is what come to my mind. You're about to see everything that you have manifested in the past come to fruition. And it's going to come to fruition really fast. It's already coming to fruition. You're about to say... Look what God has done for me. You're probably already saying it. The people you divorced, and what I mean by divorce, not just divorce as in a husband or a wife, but people that you have divorced in your life. Divorce means separated. So people that you have separated from. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Some of my Christmas decorations is moving. That is confirmation. But a lot of people that you divorced in the past, May it be family, friends, husband, wife, children, or whatever. Whoever you removed out your life that was no longer serving you, your ancestors is now taking over and taking care of those that you removed. And you got to be weary and mindful because I feel that someone is trying to set you up. Um, and the reason being is because they're very jealous of you. They want your talents. They want your gifts. And they were killed to do it. Um, the people that's coming back, you're going to have a new love, but be weary of the new love from the past or anybody from the past, present, or future because you are a illuminate one and you're very gifted. And when, when others already know that, you don't have to tell them that. And they're jealous of that. They're jealous of your gifts. Because they know where your gifts is going to take you. And it's your birthright to be wealthy. And wealth is already here. But it's really coming. A windfall is coming towards your way. So that is the reason why you were prepared for this day. Because God wanted to remove anything that no longer served you. So when, you, when your manifestations come to fruition and the universe grants you everything that you desire and everything that you have worked for, they want to make sure that basically your head is all right. Basically you're mentally strong. And you're too mentally strong for someone in your past, okay? You're way too mentally strong, okay? You know, you ever heard that saying, when you think you're fucking mean, you're fucking yourself? Um, when you're a hierophant, I'm going to say this. I wouldn't be afraid of being set up because it's no such thing as being set up when you're a hierophant. Because you are sent to pull the demons and the devils in so that they can be caught. Okay? If you're an illuminate one, you understand what I'm saying. Okay? So let's get into the reading. That was just a, a message. Okay. They were sent, basically, what I'm hearing is to mind fuck you. To keep you stagnant. To fuck your emotions up. To stir your emotions up. <laughs> guys, guys, guys. I tell you, people funny. Okay. Okay, let's see. Let's see what the Holy Spirit wants you to see. Okay, we have ten of spring. We have two. 
we have Ten of Spring and we have Ace of Autumn. Okay, Ten of Spring is saying, ask for help from others. All work and no play. Being weighed down by too many responsibilities. Okay, guys, as hierophants and as religious um, workers, we are very weighed down. And we can find ourselves doing a lot by ourselves. Because you can't trust a lot of people. Okay? That's like me and Prashoshe. It's not like I said, okay, I'm going to let this of that person go. I had to. Because if you don't let it go, your, your angels, ancestors, God is going to remove them regardless. Okay? Ace of Autumn. Hey, what, didn't I just tell y'all this? I, can, I should shut the reading down. A windfall of money, advice, or assistance from others. A very successful project, a happy change in your career. You're getting ready to see money, divine feelings you've never seen in your life. Again, because it's your birthright. So you need to be weary of who you're dealing with. I got this message when I was sitting here just now. Okay? Look, it was at the bottom of the deck. The lovers. Okay? Did I not just tell you guys that? It's going to be a lover coming in showing you fake love. Acting like they really want to, they really change and I really want to be with you. And oh, they're going to just show you. They're fucking lying. And it's saying true love that is long lasting. Choices made from the heart. A return to good health. Meaning a return to any type of bad that anybody was trying to send your way. People was doing voodoo dolls on, 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 on you. I was about to say on us. People was doing voodoo dolls, candle work, candle magic, mirror work, um, mirror scribing. This is all came to me as a message. Half this shit, I don't even know how to do it myself. Okay? But now, since you have shown yourself to them and the world, they want to come in and say, okay, I want, I want you. Okay? Be very mindful. When you possess these type of gifts, people want to know how you know the things you know, how you're doing the things you're doing. Some people are not of the light. They don't worship the Holy Spirit. They are devil worshipers. Okay? And as luminate ones, we are to pull them in to capture them. So that they can be caught to all the deceit, the vindictive de um, deception, all the lies, and these people are going to be caught by their own lies, by their own tales. Their mask is going to fall off right before your very eyes. This is what the Holy Spirit is telling me. They're going to show you who they are themselves. This is why they don't want to be around you a whole lot. Because they trying to see what you know, how you know it. Who's telling this to you? <laughs> because you are the high priestess. Trust in your intuition. Careful reflection before you take an action. Insights that come through meditation. Man, I love this detox because that's all I've been doing was meditating, praying, and fasting. Well, you know, with detox is fasting. Okay. And trust and believe. It will give you clarity like no other. Look what just came out. Release. Let go of the past. And ending that makes a way for new opportunities. Time to move on. Whoever you guys are dealing with from the past, don't answer their phone calls anymore. Don't text them anymore. Don't communicate. Because they're only connecting with you for finances. Okay? They want to take from you sexually, emotionally, physically, mentally, all that shit. 
They know who you are. They've been to who you were. And they're a taker. They don't want to give anything. They just want to take. And as long as you deal with this person, your opportunities is never going to come to fruition. And your opportunities is already here. But they were the ones that was keeping you stuck. Doing these voodoo dolls, doing all this magic, doing all this old sick shit. They were trying to keep you stuck, but see, they didn't know you was the fucking hierophant. And by you being the hierophant, it doesn't work. Whatever they do to you goes back on them. They wish death on you, death is on them. They wish ill health on you, ill health go to them. Whatever they wish upon you, go back to them 20 times over, return the fucking sender. And by you being the hierophant, you don't even have to say return the sender. You don't have to say anything. Your ancestors and God have caught them in their tracks. This is what they don't get. Because they're stupid. And see, one thing about being evil, you think you're smarter than everybody else, but you're not. Just sit down and pay attention. That's all you do. Be still and know that I am God. For all the debt that you have experienced, all the wrongdoings, all the hurt, all the rejection in the past, present, and or future, you're about to be given all that back in abundance. It says nine of autumn. Reward yourself for all your hard work, being happy and successful, self-employed, cherishing your time alone. Guys, look at this. That's all I just told you guys at the beginning of the reading without the cards. The cards are just confirmation. You do whatever you want to do. But as I told you guys from the beginning, Emperor Shay Shay take heed also. This is my Divine Feminine cards. I don't want to make this reading too long, guys. Because Emperor Shay Shay is going to get some rest. I said I was supposed to get some rest today and I was... I was still trying to get stuff for my house and everything so that I could rest. But I'm finished now. I am done with Christmas. I decided to put ribbons on the tree. Okay. Let's see. It says, Layla, the saint of spoken words. Every word I say becomes a prayer. I am the author of my own story. Look at that. The mother of God, Mary of Nazareth. I am blessed. My courage gives birth to the divine. Diana, queen of the wilderness. The language of the natural world is a frequency of love. This is my mother's tongue. Teresa of Avalia. I trust the answers I find within myself. I know that the presence of love is real. You know what they're talking about? God, um, <laughs> I was talking to God. You hear what I said? You know what they was talking about, God? Guys, I talk to God and my angels constantly. I was <laughs> I was about to talk to God while I taped it with you guys. Um, I was talking to God like he's right here with me. <laughs> he always with me, though. Know, you guys have witnessed that. But anywho, um, they're talking about the love that you have within yourself. The love of the Holy Spirit. The love of the divine. Guys, you don't need anybody to love you. You love yourself. Pour you into your own cup. Someone's past is going to be very shocked when they try to communicate because you're not going to be no longer there. You're done. I can feel the energy. You have finally made peace with the situation. You know this person is playing games, mind games, sexual games, you know, any type of games. And they're in with a female. I'm hearing a cancer female. They're working as a team with their family members. Guys, let me know if this resonates with you, okay? I may even try to watch a little Netflix tonight. I don't watch TV, but... The Holy Spirit is saying, Shay Shay, you need to relax. 